Hey there, this is Eric, and this is a really quick tip on how to move cat objects or cat rigs around in its entirety. So a lot of times when people will create a cat rig, so for example, if I just use the standard base human, and so everything looks to be good. We can move it around, we can try to animate it. And you'll notice that as I move it back and forth, the base object moves on its own. Now one thing to keep in mind is this is not your animation. Um, this is not for animating, basically. Instead, what you want to do is you want to jump over to the motion panel, go into the layer manager, create a new absolute layer. Now every layer inside of cat has its own transform capability. And so what you want to do is once you have a layer selected, you want to turn on this right down here, which is the display layer transform. When you do that, You'll notice that the character snaps back, and if we take a very close look, there's a little box right here in the middle. Now, sometimes you can use um, additional objects that this is, you know, driven by, but this is what you want to animate when moving your character around. So, let us go back to our main object, turn on animate. You'll notice, again, nothing working. But if we select our transform, turn on auto key, we'll just move them off to the side. Turn it off. You can see now the character is moving along with it. Now if I select the base here again, and I just go and I create yet another layer on top of this, and show its transform layer. I'm going to hide the original, go over here, and in this case, I'm going to animate it forward. Okay. So if I select the base or any part of the cat rig again, notice what's happening there. It's showing the two individual skeletons and how I've been moving them. Now, since these are absolute layers, they're not going to contribute to each other's uh, result unless we start to modify the weights. Okay, now this looks pretty confusing, but just keep in mind, this purple skeleton corresponds to our purple layer. Our red skeleton corresponds to the red layer. And so as these two move, you can see we have two very different animations for our base. And you can blend them, do whatever you want with it. So a lot of times when people are doing animation with cat, they'll treat it kind of like a traditional rig. They'll just grab the base here and try to animate that. But what you need to do is you need to animate the transform object. Okay. Now keep in mind that you can't link this to another object. So here I'll show you really quick. So there's our little sphere. If I take this guy and link it. If I now move this, nothing happens. Okay, so um, hopefully this helps. Cheers.